First things first, I want to say a big shout out to the homie Midnight Man. I'll leave his links in the description box down below. Go check out his channel. Very awesome dude. Now, let's get into this video. What's going on, you wonderful people? My name is Brandon. Welcome back. Creating TV. So in today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to record your desktop audio using Streamlabs OBS on a Mac. I know a lot of you guys have been liking the last video. So if you're new here, like these type of videos, subscribe if you're new. I wanna say one thing, new subscribers, welcome. Welcome to Creating TV. So let's get into this video. So first things first, what you wanna do is, you wanna go to I, uh, you know, shiny white box I have, but it's really called, it's the I show you audio capture. This helps you record your uh, desktop audio, especially if you're streaming, you know, you wanna play some background music for your viewers, you know, get the desktop audio. So this link will also be in the description box below. So if you have Catalina, you go here. If not, everybody else goes here. You download it, you know, it even show you steps by steps, how to download, what you need to do, everything else. After you install it, make sure you do, like it says right here, go to your uh, security and privacy and system preferences and your, uh, and your settings, you know, system preferences. You should go there first to allow it to install to open up because it won't open up without it so i know that's one thing but then, you know it, there is steps on here you what you, you got to do just follow that so once you download that the audio interface you're gonna go to system preferences and you go to your security and privacy you click it in there put in your password allow it downloads for the finished install you'd be good to go then from there what you're going to go to you're going to go to search you're going to get up to search and you're going to search for audio there it is right there mid setup Click on that. When that pops up, you want to create a multi-output device. So you're going to come down here to this plus sign right here. When you click on that plus sign, it'll say create multi-output device, but I'm not going to do it because I already have one. Once you do that, uh, you won't see Prasanya's audio box because I have an audio box interface that's hooked up with my Mac and everything else. But what you want to do is you see my HyperX Quadcast, what I'm streaming from. You want yours is going to just say, I show you audio capture and you need the MacBook speakers or iMac speakers, whatever you're using. You just want to check those two. Drift correction, you want to take off make sure your master device at the top says i show you i show you audio capture and then the sample rate just you can put yours to 44 but since i have an audio interface or if you have an audio interface you can click that one too me and mine can power 48 volts so i i just set mine to 44 48 but just set yours to 44 you know just leave it there and make sure that masters up so after you after you create that mass multi output uh device after you create that close that then from there what you want to do is you go to system preferences go to sound now you see where it says multi output device aggregated device you want to click on that once you click on that you're all good to go now you can close that then you'll open up your Streamlabs, Streamlabs obs so if you want to get the desktop audio and everything you see my game capture already is already going so you see that you see the microphone audio is going so you see both of those so what you want to do you want to go back over here to settings go to audio and then down here where it says device disabled to want to create put that on i show you audio capture and bam hit done that's gonna pop up now you go okay well the game audio in there so you see both is going now if you don't believe me that it works here let me show you minimize that here and there you go you see the desktop audio is gone that desktop audio is going, hyper is going, game capture is going. So that's how you want to go do it if you want to record your desktop audio and everything else. Now, let me minimize this. Close that out. So four, but when you're that's only when you're streaming, you know, you want to interact with your viewers. Your viewers tell you play some Spotify music, you know, you know, music that's not gonna get you copyrighted and everything else. Or if you have an account with Epidemic Sounds, you know, you can play your uh, audio desktop music in the background for your viewers, you know, interact with your chat and everything else. Now, when you finish streaming, anything else, you, what you want to do, you want to go back to settings, go back to sound and change it to either MacBook Pro speakers or iMac Pro speakers, whatever, iMac speakers interface. Because if you don't, you leave it on that, it'll kind of sound kind of weird and everything else. So just change it back to that. But you only change it to aggregated device when you're streaming, you know, you want to interact with your viewers. For me, I'm going to put mine back to my audio interface, audio box so it can sound. But that's all you got to do, just every time you finish. Because if not, you might, it sounds kind of weird and everything else, and you just leave it that. So I just put mine back to there and, you know, that's it. That's just how you do that. But the link to that will be down in the description box below. If you did enjoy this video, this is how you record the desktop audio using Streamlabs OBS with the I show you audio capture. I know everybody that used to use Soundflower that does not work anymore. So if you like this video, like this video, subscribe if you're new. We're on our way to 700 subscribers. Woo! We should be in 
there soon, dog. Hopefully by the summer, or at least by September, we can hit a thousand. But other than that, hope you did enjoy this video. Stay tuned for more videos coming out about Streamlabs OBS. Go watch my previous videos if you haven't already. And other than that, this is your boy Brandon coming to you from Creating TV, and I'm signing out. God bless everybody. Peace.